running for MRC. I ran for AMRC in this last semester. I, I understand that this is a very big position. There's a lot of work going into it. I hope that you guys are willing to work with me. I know I'm going into it late and most of the stuff is already planned out, which will be very helpful. But at the same time, I don't know a lot of the rules. So I'm really looking to you guys to help me a little bit. I want to make this position as best it can be. Um, and with that, I'm going to need your help for it. Um, I have been looking up some of the rules myself online this summer. Haven't gotten to all of them. I'm, I know I'm missing some. But I hope to work with Meg and the e rest of Ebor to help learn those um, rules of what I can and can't do, how um, recruitment actually works. Um, so I understand that this position is a very outgoing position. You need to be able to be talkative and stuff. I know I look standoffish and sometimes I am. But I feel last semester when we went bowling um, with Alpha Ups, I did really well. I was outgoing. I made some connections. I think that this position will be good for me and help me get out of my comfort zone, which I do need. Um, so this would help both me and the new girls getting to know each other. So it's a cooperative experience for all of us. Um, I do like the bumping idea. Some of, I know we had a little trouble with um, getting the groups and making sure everybody stayed kind of on task, I guess would be a way to say it. I'm not really sure. Um, but I'd like to practice that again. I like the cards. I felt they were helpful in helping us narrow down the girls and make sure that they fit best for us as a whole. Um, I have been looking up ways to try and get that so they're not paper cards, so they're actually online, um, so it would be easier for everyone because recruitment nights are late and everybody kind of just wants to go home at the end of the night, not sit around and fill out some cards. So I want to find a way to make a poll maybe, get the girls' names on there, and like numbers, and then you click on them. I haven't figured it out yet. I'm trying. I'm still looking. <laughs> um, so I want to keep those. I think they worked really well last semester. Both sets, even the bumping. Um, I also am helping the freshmen move in in the fall. Um, next week, actually. And um, that will help the girls helping them move in make connections and help them get to know us a lot better, which I find will be very helpful to add to or make a list of potential girls um, for us. And um, I also would like to invite girls to like little places, like make a connection with them and then be like, hey, you want to go get Dunkin' Donuts or do you want to go to the DC with me for lunch? Just little things. So it's more of a personal experience getting to know the girls rather than just a party or just in passing, just like, hi, I'm from Fising. So more of a, hi, I'm Brittany, I'm a junior and this is like my major, what are your interests and stuff, rather than it being all about Phi Sig in a very Phi Sig environment. Not that that's a bad thing, I just think that sometimes it can overwhelm some girls. So dialing it back until we get to recruitment and just inviting them to simple places like that I think will be very helpful for them, getting to know us and us getting to know them. And I'm not saying like we can't have a social, I want to have a social with the new girls and possibly a hike just to show them that we're not just all about partying and stuff like that. Um, and I think, uh, or we could do bowling. Um, bowling is, has worked for us in the past. Um, I liked bowling last year. I thought it was fun. Um, I also, um, I kind of just felt restricted in bowling. I feel like we were stuck in an alley and those were the girls we talked to. So I think if we find a better way to make bowling more like of a circular thing and like move it around, I don't know. I like bowling, girls like bowling, so we can just keep it as it is or make some changes. 
I'm up for anything. Um, I worked two jobs this summer. Oh no, I'm over time. I went two jobs this summer, so I have a lot of money saved up. I'm also looking for a job in Keene, so money won't be a problem to front. That's all right with me. Um, I really just want to make Meg's visions as best they can be and maybe even build upon them. I um, really hope you guys will consider me for this position. I'm very excited, so if you guys have any questions, let me know. Thank you.